Hey there, Ryan Lilly with Old Town. Today I'm actually at my home gym, CrossFit Bangor, here in Maine, to talk to you about wellness. As you know, living a healthy, balanced life throughout the year is an important aspect to enjoying your life and time on the water to its fullest. I'm joined today by Carl Minton of CrossFit Bangor. Thanks so much for having me, Carl. Absolutely. So water sports, such as uh, paddling, uh, consists of a lot of the same movements. You know, you move your boat on the water, but you also have to do a lot of moving your boat off the water, transporting your boat uh, from the truck to the water, from the water back to your truck or on top of your vehicle. Um, there's a lot of risk for injury there. Are there some common movements uh, or, or exercises that we should consider to reduce the risk of injury? Sure, so moving your boat around, you can, uh, we do deadlifts at the gym, you can do them at the house too. Uh, clean and jerks, uh, push press, anything that involves moving that weight from the ground to overhead. Gotcha, so a deadlift would look a lot like lifting, um, you know, grabbing the bow handle of your kayak and just and, standing and up hoisting that up. That's exactly right. And then a clean and jerk looks a lot like lifting that to chest level Exactly. And then a push press is the act of almost putting Push that boat up yep. on the rack on top of your truck. Yes. Gotcha, gotcha. Could you um, talk a little bit about uh, why it's important to work on these lifts um, in the off season? Absolutely, so you don't wanna show up to the lake uh, green and uh, not doing these movements and risk, risk getting injured doing it. So you could practice in the off season with your boat or with your backpack, day pack, anything, any, anything that offers a little bit of resistance, you can do those movements with. So belonging to a gym is important because you can, you can practice all of this, but you don't necessarily need to be a part of a gym in order to, to practice these movements and to work on this no, throughout the year. No, these movements, anybody can do them and you probably do them throughout your daily life anyway without even realizing it, but we just put a label on them at the gym. So can you sh actually demonstrate for us what these, the, what these movements look like? Absolutely. So basically, you're a deadlift, your weight is going to be in front of you, whether it's your boat or your bag or backpack or whatever. You're just going to set yourself up in front of it and uh, stoop down and just lift it up. Gotcha. Using, you know, trying not to use your back, use your legs more than anything. So. Gotcha. Okay, and then uh, for the clean and jerk, could you demonstrate what a clean and jerk looks like? A clean and jerk is also uh, from the ground. You're just going to bring it up to your chest, bring that weight up to your chest which is the clean part of it. Yep. And then a jerk would be pushing it overhead. Gotcha. And then how about the push press? Could you demonstrate that for us? A push press is also, uh, so if you say your weight is on top of your car already, it's already up high, you're just gonna hold it there and then press it up over your head. Carl, thank you so much for having us. I appreciate it. If you wanna learn more, visit CrossFitBangor.com or OldTownCanoe.com.